It's Saturday, folks. Saturday. You know, it's weird because I've been in this awkward emotional place lately where it's like, first of all, hey, you know, first to three days off, digging it. Um, I've been in this weird place where I understand the importance of going to work and taking care of things, but also because I've been in the rare position that everything is just fine, I've been finding reasons to be lazy. And that laziness, if it persists, could eventually lead to us having problems. So I'm trying to snap myself out of that. For example, uh, Thursday, Asia asked me was I taking Friday off so that I could have a four-day weekend for my birthday. I was like, absolutely not. I need to be able to get in here and do the work. I haven't worked a full work week in almost a month because something will always happen. There's a there's a scheduled like state holiday and I get a day off. Or our anniversary came up last month. So I took that off and Friday and then moved right into a two-day weekend well, you know, Saturday and Sunday, but then that next following Monday was a holiday, so I got like five days off, so that means that I only would have worked four days the following week, but I ended up calling off twice, so I only worked like two days, and as a result, my check was very small, but while it was the free check, I say free check in the sense that there's no such thing as a free check, but the check where all our bills were paid and nothing was accounted for was smaller than it could have been and I could have done more had I just gone to work so I've been painting myself into this corner but I need to understand that do I have an easy job and all I really have to do is be there show up stand around do the work they pay me for it I feel pretty secure in my job. It's always weird because the second I get in somewhere good, some extenuating shit happens. Like the the incident with Downtown Sacramento Partnership, honestly, I can look back at that now and say that was my fault. Kari got into it with a cop being snarky and I had a warrant for some shit that I hadn't taken care of in like 2014 so that was all my fault to save face the company let me go but I collected unemployment so it was fine so then I really thought like after that nothing would be cooler you know like I peaked like downtown Sacramento partnership was all I did was walk around all day I'm not gonna be able to beat that then I got a regional transit job where all I had to do was walk around the station for less time and make more money and I was like holy crap this is the best and what's funny is on my first day I'd have to go back and find the video on my first day at regional transit I remember walking home and one of the guards stopped me and he was like yeah man we're trying to start a union more pay better money I was like uh man I really just got this job I don't want to rock the boat but that was a prelude to almost a year later our company lost that contract with regional transit and as a result i found myself on unemployment again it was it was kind of a bummer but not my fault at all i also neglected to mention that after i had gotten used to being on my station they promoted me put me in a truck so really i was just sitting around in my truck watching netflix and waiting for something to go wrong and it rarely did so i really thought that that was the epitome i would never do better and while i haven't done better in terms of comfort i am comfortable at my job i do save money because it's closer when i was working in the truck uh, i spent almost 500 dollars a month just on transportation instead of just buying a car but it was it was always something so I am very comfortable with what I'm doing now I'm very relaxed with the people that I work with Asia is going to work and it'll just be guard work so it'll be it'll be good shit I feel good about it I really do um, that being the case just get up and take your ass to work Harris 
Like, come on, Phantom. Seriously, just get in there and fucking do it. So, next week, uh, I got a four-day work week because I'm taking Monday off for my birthday. But after that, it's got to be like, I got to go ahead and just get to work. You know, full fucking schedules. Let's get it done. I'm fortunate enough to have a job where I don't have to worry about hours. Hey, how you doing? So how about I just fucking show up? Uh, speaking, I'm in the store, so let me go. About to pull out some money so I can support my weed habit. So, uh, yeah, I should go. Deuces.